Miss Magic's Learning Adventures. Hi everyone, my name's Miss Magic and I'm so happy you're here. Would you like to go on a learning adventure with me? Great, today we're going camping. Do you like to go camping? Fantastic! I've already set up my tent. Can you point to the tent and say, right there? Great job! Camping is so much fun. You can camp in a tent, you can camp in a camper, or you can even camp in a sleeping bag out under the stars. How do you like to camp? I like that too. We're camping in the woods. Some other places you can camp are in the mountains. You can camp by a river, a lake, or even the ocean. You can even camp in your own backyard. Some fun things to do when you're camping is to go hiking, to go fishing. You can go swimming in some water. You can also go to the beach. Some people like to just relax and enjoy the nature. What do you like to do when you're camping? That's fun too. Can you tell me what I have on my back? Yes, it's my camping backpack. I have my list of things I was supposed to bring. And now we're gonna check to make sure I brought them all. So here I have my tent, and inside is my sleeping bag. That's where I'm gonna sleep tonight. I also have chocolate, marshmallows, and graham crackers. Do you know what I'm gonna make with all of those? Yes, s'mores. S'mores are one of the best things about camping. I brought my sunscreen, a hat, and sunglasses, all to protect me from the sun. So you wanna make sure you take all of those when you go camping too. I have my binoculars because we're gonna go on a hike in a little bit and we wanna look for animals. Can you help me with that? Great. I have lots and lots of water because we wanna stay hydrated because when we're out in the sun a lot, you gotta stay hydrated. So make sure you drink lots of water I have my snacks and my food. I also have books and coloring books. And depending on where you're from, you might need some mosquito spray. Are you ready to go on a hike with me? Great, you gotta get out your binoculars. You can make O's with your fingers and you can put them right here. And these binoculars are gonna help you see animals in the woods. Can you put your binoculars on your face? Great job. And let me get my binoculars too. These are my binoculars and they'll help me see things far away. Can you tell me what this is? Yes, it's my backpack. I have lots of water in my backpack to go on this hike. I also already put on my sunscreen, I have my hat, and I also have sunglasses. That will all protect us. Are you ready to go on our hike? Let's do it. Here we go, get your binoculars out. We're hiking through the woods. We're hiking through the woods. <gasps> Do you see what I see? What is it? Yes, it's a squirrel. We should be really quiet so the squirrel doesn't hear us. Oh, that is such a cute squirrel. Okay, let's keep hiking through the woods. I'm hiking through the woods. We're hiking through the woods. I really enjoy hiking through the woods. Do you see what I see? Wow. 
It's a deer. Have you ever seen a deer before? They're very sweet, aren't they? Let's just watch and enjoy the deer. Wow, what a special moment. Let's keep walking through the woods now. We're walking through the woods. We're walking through the woods. <gasps> I hear something. I hear something rustling in the trees. Do you see that? What is it? Yes, it's a snake. Wow. We want to keep a safe distance from the snake. Okay, we'll see you later, snake. Bye. We're walking through the woods. We're walking through the woods. Oh, do you hear that? Can you see it? What is it? Yes, it's a beautiful bird in the tree. I love that. Do you like birds? Have a good day, bird. Wow, this has been such a great hike so far. I think it's a good time to take a break and drink some water. Do you have some water to drink? We definitely want to stay hydrated on our walk today. This is the best hike ever. Can you get back out your binoculars? Make sure you have your hands right up by your eyes and they help you see the animals in the woods. All right, let's keep going. We're walking through the woods. We're walking through the woods. <gasps> what do you see? It's a mama bear with her baby cub. We want to stay far away, but let's watch them. Isn't that special? Okay, I think it's time that we get back to the campground and we make our fire. Let's go. I want you to meet my friend, Leo. Can you say, hi, Leo? Hello. <laughs> Leo, you're so silly. <laughs> How are you today, Leo? I'm good. How are you, Miss Magic? Oh, I'm great. My friends and I just went on a hike, and we love everything about camping. Oh, I bet. So I. We heard that you brought your camper today. Oh, yeah, I did. It's fun. Do you think you could give us a tour of your camper? Yeah, let's go. Okay, great. Hi, Leo. Hi, Miss Magic. Thank you so much for inviting us into your camper. You're welcome. Come on in. Wow, this is so nice, Leo. Thank you. How long have you been camping in a camper? For a while now. I got it because I like fishing and enjoying hiking and just going camping. So I wanted something very comfortable and relaxing. Yeah, it's so big. It's so much bigger than my tent. Yeah, my camper is pretty big. It's just the right size for me. <laughs> yes. Okay, well, thank you, Leo. You're so welcome. Hey, it's Leo. We're going to collect sticks to create our campfire. Do you want to help me collect five sticks? There's one. Okay, now we got to start a stick pile. Let's put it right there. 
Good job. Can you help me find another one? There's two. Yay. Okay, let's put it in our stick pile. Awesome job, guys. Can you help me find another one? Okay, there's three. Good job. Okay, let's put it in the stick pile. This is gonna be such a good fire. We're looking for two more sticks, okay? There's four. Let's put it on the pile. And we're looking for the last stick. Do you see it? Five, good job everyone. Let's put it on the pile. And let's start our fire. We just had a very healthy dinner. So now we're gonna have something really special. Ooh. Can you tell me what these are? Yes, they're graham crackers. And Leo, can you tell me what this is? Oh, that's chocolate! Yes! And then there's one more ingredient. What are these? Marshmallows! Marshmallows! So now we're going to put our marshmallow on our stick. And with this, you definitely want a grown-up to help you because you don't want to poke yourself with your stick. You're welcome. Okay, now you want to lean back from the fire. You want to have a safe distance from the fire and always have a grown-up with you. And then you can put your marshmallow over the fire. Wow! This is really fun, Leo! Yeah! How do you like your marshmallow cooked? Golden brown. Mm. That's how I like it, too. Oh, wow. Okay, I think they're about ready. Yeah, it is. Our s'mores are ready. Oh, yeah. Do you want to take a little taste of mine? Oh, please. Mmm. Mm. Oh, that's my first s'more ever. That's so good. Mmm. So delicious! Hey Leo, can I teach you something? Yeah, I love learning things. Oh great, I want to teach you how to have a memory stamp on something. A memory stamp? Yeah. What's that? Well, when I traveled the whole world, I would do something where I called it a memory stamp. And I would use all five senses, and I would take in the moment, and then I could remember it in my heart forever. That sounds magical. So we're going to go over our five senses so you know what they are. Okay. You have your sight, so what you see with your eyes. You have your nose, where you smell. You have your taste, which what you taste with your mouth. You have your hearing, what noises you hear. And then you have what you feel, maybe on your skin. Or you can even have it be what you feel in your heart. So, that sounds awesome. let's go ahead and take a look at what we see. I see my friend Leo here with me. I see a campfire. I see us out in the woods. And I also see birds. What do you see? You see all of those things? Yeah. Oh, great. And I smell campfire. I smell grass. And what do you smell? Camping! Oh, and marshmallows. Yeah, that's fun. And then what I taste, I still have the taste of my s'more in my mouth and it tastes so delicious. And what do we hear? I hear the sound of fire crackling. 
I hear the sound of birds. Yeah. I hear kids laughing and adult conversation. And then I'm going to think about, hmm, what do I feel? Well, on my skin, I feel the warmth of the fire. I feel the little bit of wind. And so it's just great. So that's how you make a memory stamp. You think of what you see, hear, smell, taste, and feel. And then you make a memory stamp because when you think of all those things, you're really living in the moment. And that's what we want to do. That sounds amazing. Well, thanks for joining me with making a memory stamp. You're welcome. I'm happy I could join you. Leo, I think it's the perfect time to tell campfire stories. Oh, campfire stories. Yes. That's basically where you just tell a story that might be true, or you can also use your imagination. Oh, yeah? Yeah, do you want to tell a campfire story? Yeah. Great. Okay. So once upon a time, there was a boy named Leo. That's me. <laughs> so this boy named Leo, he decided to go camping out in the woods under the stars by himself. All they took was a sleeping bag. As he was enjoying his little campsite, enjoying the nature and taking in all of his five senses, we learned that earlier. Yes. Then he finally decided to go to sleep in his sleeping bag. And just as soon as he was about to fall asleep, an owl swooped down. They're very big, small bodies, big wings. But he swooped down and decided to hang out with me. So we collected sticks and we built a fort and we were having fun. Then all of a sudden, I wake up. Wow, Leo, that was a really good story. Thanks, Miss Magic. Leo did such a great job at using his imagination. Now it's time to put out the fire. Let's pour some water all over the fire. We want to make sure we pour water on it until there's no more light left. This is for all of our safety and also the animals in the woods because we don't want a fire to spread to the woods. Now that it's nighttime, we're going to look at the stars. Do you know what this is called? Yes, it's a telescope. Telescope. When you look through a telescope, you can see things far, far away like the stars. Wow, I see a shooting star. Whoa. Leo, do you want to see? Yeah, let me look. Whoa, that's a big dipper. So cool! You know what I think? I think it's time to sing Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. That sounds fun! Okay, ready? Yeah. Twinkle Twinkle Little Star How I wonder what you are Up above the world so high like a diamond in the sky, twinkle, twinkle, little star, how I wonder what you are. Thank you, Leo. You're welcome. Thank you, Miss Magic. You're welcome. Words of the day. It's the words of the day.
The first word of the day is hike. 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 Can you say hike? Nice. Now let's do it together. One, two, three. Hike. Hike in Spanish is caminada. Caminada. Ka mi na da. Can you say caminada? Good job. The next word of the day is tent. Tent. T -t tent. Can you say tent? Good job. Tent in Spanish is carpa. Carpa. Can you say carpa? Fantastic. The next word of the day is fire. 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 F -f fire. Can you say fire? Good job. Fire in Spanish is fuego. Fuego. Can you say fuego? Excellent. The next word of the day is water. Water. Wa wa wa. Water. Can you say water? Nice. Water in Spanish is agua. Agua. Can you say agua? Yes, good job. The last word of the day is tree. T -t 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 tree. Can you say tree? Yes, good job. Tree in Spanish is arbol. Arbol. Can you say arbol? Wonderful! Can you tell me what this is? Yes, it's a tent. Tent in sign language is tent. You take your index fingers and your pinkies, you put them together, and then you go diagonal and down. Tent. Can you try it? Good job! Now let's do it together. Ready? One, two, three. Tent. Do you want to learn some more words in sign language? Say, more please. More please. Can you tell me what this is? Say it really loud. Yes, it's a tree. Tree in sign language is to do this, you take one hand and you place it palm down. You take the other arm and you put the elbow on top and you wave your hand. Tree. Can you do it with me? Ready? One, two, three. Tree. Good job. Now let's do more, please. Can you say more, please? Tell me what this is. Yes, it's someone hiking. Hiking. To show hiking in sign language, you're going to have three fingers straight out, then you take your green finger and your pinkies and you bend them, and you move your hands back and forth. Can you try it? 
Nice. Now let's do it together on the count of three. One, two, three. Hiking. Or hike. Good job. Now, are you ready to learn a few more words in sign language? Say, more please. More please. Can you tell me what this is? Yes, it's a fire. Fire. To learn fire in sign language, you're gonna straighten your hands up, wiggle your fingers, and move them a little bit. Fire. Can you try it? Nice job. Now let's do it together on the count of three. One, two, three. Fire. Do you wanna learn one more word? Say, more please. More, please. Can you tell me what this is? Yes, it's water. Water in sign language is this. You take three fingers up where it makes a W and you tap your chin twice. Water, can you try it? Great job. Now let's do it together on the count of three. One, two, three. Water. Thank you so much for joining me today. I had such a great time with you. I look forward to seeing you again real soon. And please subscribe. I also have other videos that you can watch if you look at my channel. Bye!